Hi, welcome to the Violet Realm. Hey guys. Thanks. Uh, thank you for joining us today on a uh, new pick a card for um, what's it called? Um, who's having sweet thoughts about you? That's right. So we use the candy canes. Yes, I thought it was really cute. I don't yeah. know. All right, so you guys have. We'll do the, this is group number one right here. You got this pink one that has blue on it and like red. Cute. And then we have Yule Rebirth. That's such a beautiful card. Number two, we got this blue candy cane with blue and purple in it. I have Chalice Fulfillment. Love that energy. And then we have the classic, you know, peppermint. And then we have um, Watchtower of the North Winter. Thought it would be a fun little theme. Yeah, it is. It's really fun. Okay. All water. So take a second and kind of meditate and think about what resonates with you the most on who's having sweet thoughts about you this this holiday season yeah. although it is timeless so but the theme is cute yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right we'll so, see you on the other side yeah we'll see you on the other side hey group number one hi group one so you'll rebirth all right i love that card i, I, I resonate too. with that a lot this is so cute you can't really see this it's fine I don't know if it'll that, here, that'll be, that'll work just like that. We'll just do it like that. So you want me to just lay the cards down? Yeah, we'll just lay all the cards down and then we'll... And then we'll, put it in. well, we'll figure this card thing out. Oh, here are my cards. I can move these. That'd be great. It's okay. I'll put it there. Hmm. What do we got here? That's the Eight of Cups. Panther Spirit. We oh, got the one. Eight of Cups. We got Panther Spirit. We got Capricorn I use. We got Play. We got Unbound. Let's do a tarot last. Yeah. Wow. Play, Unbound. We have, I don't know how to say that. Avesca Pisces. We have Relax, The Hold of Darkness, and Be at Cause. Wow. We have the perfection of your life. I've never pulled this card. So that's cool. We have seeing the true you. Whoa. All right. I'm trying to kind of line these up so you can spread out some more cards. There you go. Cool. You can do the tarot. Let's do yours first. Okay, we got the two of pentacles. Oh, love that energy. We got the three of wands. Awesome. Someone's yes. definitely <laughs> made a decision. Yeah. Oh, we got the king of wands. Whoa. Someone is having some real, real sweet thoughts about you. Yeah. They want to love you. They want to take care of you. Oh, we got the king of cups. We got the ace of wands. Whoa. We got the two of swords. We got the hair font. We got the seven of pentacles in reverse. And we got the tower in reverse. All right. So it's, I, I feel like this is love. Yeah. I this feel is like, like, let's get married. I let's, do feel like someone is overthinking it. Yeah. I, I get that too. Um, there probably needs to be a conversation about having feelings for each other, or maybe you guys are just hooking up and y'all don't realize that y'all really do actually like each other. Do it. I mean, what's there to lose? Right. You know, there's always other people. Right. Um, with this, I feel like they're just really driving themselves crazy about you. Yeah. And with this, it's kind of like you guys have gotten into a friendship or kind of a pattern in your relationship that's kind of constructive emotionally. 
reclaim your power. Right. It's like saying, um, I want something more. And I deserve something more if I want that. Right. If that, if you resonate with that. Capricorn is I use. So you might, you might feel like you are being used. Um, there's two ways you can go about this. If you don't really like the person and you don't really see a future with them, just see how it is. Play, have fun, have a conversation. Mm -hmm. Communicate with them. Let them know how you feel. If you feel like they you guys aren't on the same page just let them know hey i just i don't feel like really going steady or you know having titles or anything like that it's not how i feel and if you feel the other way i would really encourage you to talk to this person because i feel like they are thinking about you often i think there is in the back of their mind or maybe in the forefront of a relationship with you I'm feeling, um, with this Capricorn I use and this Panther spirit here, can we just look at this Panther just a second? Let's just, let's just gaze at this Panther. This is a powerful card. This is no joke. So, reclaim your power. I think in some capacity in this connection, in this relationship, that's a huge part in it. Okay. <laughs> in some capacity in this relationship, somebody's feeling used. Be emotionally, physically, you may be feeling used or taken advantage of, or they may be feeling that way. And it may be in a small way. But there's guidance here <laughs> to reclaim reclaim your own personal power. I think you both might feel that way. Yeah. I do feel kind of a mirror type energy. Which that's that's what at this card you have two two holes merging as one presenting as one. But you know there's a king of cups here, so it really mm -hmm. symbolizes that. And then the, and then the ace of wands, so it's like emotion with passion. So I do see that someone really cares for you. You've got a king of wands here and a king of cups. And then an ace. And an ace. So, it's just perplexing because there's something, there's something hold, holding them back. Yeah, there's something holding them back. And it looks like, to me, you may be dealing with an air sign. Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. Or maybe it's just a feeling of, I don't, I need, I have to make room for them in my life. One thing know? I'm getting is that you may be feeling blocked by technology, limited by technology. Y'all may be at long distance. I got that impression as well. Yeah. Um, and that's what I'm getting. Yeah, but somebody's getting. definitely sweet on you. I mean, there's yeah. there's some sweetness here. There's some passion. There's a, there's because whoa, we have there's all the uh, there's all the suits on the table. Mm -hmm. And major arcana. We've got the couples card. I call this the other couples card. You know, the three of wands, it. passion, two coming together, and with a new idea. We've got the king of wands here. And in this deck, Wands has sexual creative overtones. Mm -hmm. So, and it's it's just more powerful for me in this deck. So, but that's what I'm getting. Yep. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you let us know if you resonate. Oh yeah, we would love to hear from you guys and leave comments um, and any questions. And be sure to like and subscribe. We appreciate you being here so much. And a big shout out to all the new subscribers. Um, we really appreciate every single one of you. And we love you guys. And um, we hope we can give more to you, more back to you guys as we figure out how to put all this together. So we appreciate you being here. And um, we'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, group number two. Hi, group two. Those of you that picked chalices, fulfillment. And then this cute little blue one. I actually kind of resonate with this group, so let's see what we get. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're going to save the tarot for last. Alright, so we got wellness. Oh, that's a beautiful card. Especially for a love reading. Mm -hmm. We got restore and replenish. Oh, I'm liking this energy Ooh. already. We got, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Okay. We got the Nightingale. 
Oh, I love, I love this card. We got a fire ant. Mm-hmm. And then, then we got the tarantula. Which is really great yeah. energy. I love the tarantula. And then we got self node life debts. Hmm. We got the queen of water. Beautiful, beautiful. We got death and rebirth. Whoa. We got the crow spirit, co create with a uh, spirit. Got dolphin spirit, this and that are true. We got take a break. And we got yes. So you got a flat out yes. Wow. That's pretty good. So, alright, I want to move some of these in here. Did we put all the animals together? A lot of animal energy here. Yeah. Healing. Lots of healing energy. Transformation. What's going on? Oh, we've got the Empress. The cup is full. We got the Nine of Swords. This was reversed. We got the Hangman. Wow. We got the Nine of Pentacles. Awesome. We got the Devil in reverse. We got the Sun. Got the Page of Pentacles. We got the um, Five of Pentacles in reverse. And then we got the Nine of Cups. And then we got Justice. So wow. you yeah, got a lot of cards. They got a lot to say to you mm -hmm. about this person that's thinking about you. And the Hangman, the Empress, the freaking Sun, this person, yes, take a break. They want to take care of you. Um, I feel like there is some boastful energy with the Dolphin Spirit of this and that is, is true. With the fire, uh, fire Ant, there might be some... Some things are hiding. They just got some skeletons in their closet. I don't feel like they killed anyone. I don't feel like they did anything terrible. I just feel like it's just something they feel shameful about, which could be anything. You know, some people carry bigger burdens that aren't mm -hmm. necessarily. I feel specifically Scorpio and Pluto here. Yeah, and then we got the Page of Page of Pentacles, and then we got the Nine of Pentacles. So they're already like making solid, grounded steps mm -hmm. to doing this with you. They're cutting out the bad habits mm -hmm. to make this positive change with you because he wants they he I don't know why he came up, but he came up. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it just they want something more, and they they think that you guys deserve each other. That's this is your justice. Mm -hmm. It's just I'm I'm tired of feeling a lack there's right. no more lack anymore i want this i'm yes. gonna go get it yes yes absolutely beautiful energy i i i'm tuning in on the transfer i think both of you have been working on yourselves mm -hmm. and i think this person's ready the cup is full okay they've done the work you're doing the work they may you may be feeling like there's a sense of pause here of holding you're in a holding situation. Um, but that will pass. That will go. I do feel like, this is weird, weird channel message, but I do feel like you at this moment, if you're watching this right when it comes out, um, I do feel like you are, you are about to meet them, but I do feel like you need to take a break and take care of yourself. Mm -hmm. There are things that you need to finish up, and there's another one more transition a spiritual enlightenment or acknowledging of yourself that needs to be done before you meet this person. And it's also learning to when to work and when to take a break. Yeah. Which, I gotta say, it's very hard to learn. It, it really is. They want you to meditate. They want you to talk to spirit. Yeah. They want you to go within, work on your wellness. I think you have been working on this. Mm -hmm. But I think this person is... There's this is 
this is karmic. Like, I don't mean it's a karmic relationship. I mean, you two coming together, it is, y'all have earned it. Mm -hmm. So, it's a karmic gift. It's a gift. This is a gift. So, you can look at it as a holiday gift or, um, but someone's definitely having sweet thoughts, for sure, about you. Just beautiful energy, beautiful cards. This is a lovely person. I think you'll know. Yes. I think if you resonate with this group, I think you already know who this person is. Or it's, like I said, with some of you who are going through that transition period, when you meet this person, it's going to be like, oh, yes. Yeah. Like, that, that's my person. Right. That's my person. Leo's here. Scorpio's here. We mm -hmm. have a lot of water element on the table. So, um, this person could be balanced in their astrology. Mm -hmm. Or um, they may have more water. And maybe some fire, a little bit of fire, um, or more fire. It could go either way. Mm -hmm. But um, this is a beautiful connection, and um, it's it's really sweet. Mm -hmm. I mean, it really is. It's very sweet, and loving, and um, healing. Um, and if you haven't met this person, it's really something to look forward to, mm -hmm. because this person's going to meet you where you are. And it's going to make it worth it. Yeah, everything you've been through, everything you've plowed through and healed and cried and released and got yourself up to go walk in the morning and do the right things and eat the right food, all of that is is for this. Not that you have to look a certain way or be a certain way. It's more of a mindset of self-care. Mm -hmm. No longer being part of an attachment being part of a proactive, positive, uh, collaborative uh, partnership, and, you know, being a couple, you mm -hmm. know, being a true couple that gives to each other mutually. Um, that's powerful. I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. I'm very impressed. Like, this is impressive energy. This is not you easy to do. You've something to look forward to. You um, know, don't already know them. Yeah, you, you really do. So, you know, if, if when it gets hard, if, if you have bad days, if you have hard and you're still... You know, keep this in mind because spirit has something for you and it's coming and it's just for you. So that's what I'm getting. So so let us know if you resonate or let us know in your comments. We'd love to hear from you. Yes, we would. We appreciate every single one of our subscribers. We, Thank you so much for being here. We it appreciate It really brings you. us a lot of fulfillment. And views. If you just, you know, came here mm -hmm. to watch, we appreciate you. It doesn't matter. We appreciate all of you being here. Yeah. So thank you guys. Don't for, uh, for, don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell button. Yeah, and um, we'll see you on the other side. Bye. Hi. Hi guys. Hi number three. Kai group number three. Those that fix the North Tower. Winter. Aww. I and want some hot chocolate when I look at that. I know. I just you know I really I just respect like. No traditional stuff. I don't know. It's a Taurus in me, I guess. I I think about being around a fire with hot chocolate. It's snowing. Yeah. You got the Christmas tree. Up. It's just or, so so sweet and beautiful. Or holiday tree or no tree or whatever you do. Yeah, I mean we don't specifically yeah. celebrate Christmas either. I just put a tree up and Yeah. I I just like the holiday, you know. I like the family vibe, it's cool. Anyway, ooh, all right, we got the tiger. For my mom. Whoa. For my Whoa. mom, that is pretty significant. Because I I get the tiger a lot. I'm going to say the tarot for last. You got create space. Oh. Hmm, I feel like someone's... It feels going, romantic. It like, feels like someone's going off the market soon, but you're making the preparations. It feels like... Inspiration. Creating space for love. I think a lot of you are single and maybe trying to find that person or trying to manifest mm -hmm. that person. We got Venus. Love. Ooh. And then we got Freya, the goddess of dis disconcernment. I spend my time wisely. I only say yes when it's a holy hell yes. Yes. Oh my gosh, I love this energy from mm -hmm. this deck. Okay. Trust your path. If you knew you'd be supported, what would you do? This they're like saying, "You're a perfect person. Yeah. Imagine it. You can have it." Right. It's true, guys. 
Groundhog spirit, time to let go. It's time to let go of that ex that you keep messing with. It's a waste of time. There you go. I said it. It's your confirmation. <laughs> Leave him alone. <laughs> well, spirit, trust the great mystery. Trust that Ooh. spirit is going to bring this person to you. Or yes. trust that they already have. If you're asking about a person, I think you found them. Yeah. If you resonate with this. Um, if you're trying to manifest them, you're doing a great job. Yeah. They're coming. And believe it. Trust and believe. Trust, Trust and believe. believe that it's coming. Because it is. But if you don't claim it, it can't come to you. You got seven of pentacles. Ooh. We do have queen of pentacles. And they're asking me to leave this reversed for some reason. Okay, we got... Weird. You got a queen of pentacles upside down twice. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, we got um, the nine of wands, I think. Nine? Mm-hmm. Nine of wands. And then we got the five of cups. And then we got the emperor. So. Wow. I just feel like there's a communication problem here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just feel like you're not on the same page. There's a great something in the works here, but someone isn't giving their energy to it anymore. Right. I feel an energy of someone might have messed up. I, I feel that there was a... This is probably about an ex, huh? All I right. see that. I, I can see it. I think there is a message here of let go. You can't make this emperor be an emperor. The emperor either, either is on the way to becoming one or is an emperor or not. I mean, look at this. I'm sorry, but look at this. Okay, someone is having negative energy. They're not looking at who's right. there. And it, it's just, that's all they're transmuting. Mm -hmm. All they're transmuting. And then you got this. That's their energy of just, I'm hoping for something better. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping for something better. I'm sorry, but that's what I see. But I feel like you can do way better. I feel like you're the tire. I feel like this is you you you're trying to create space for love for a relationship. I think you want it. You want it. And that's this beautiful. Is, this is your energy. But you are that tiger. Yeah. You don't trust your path. Yeah. Forget that. Forget that. Inspiration. Because you need someone to make you feel like these two parts. Yeah. Holy hell yes. And it won't be just yes. It'll be a holy hell yes. I can't deny it. I gotta I go. I love them. Yes. I want to be with them immediately. This, if, if there is an ex here that's on your mind and you want to know if they're having sweet thoughts of you, I think, I think this is spirit saying. It's, they probably do. But it's because of their own selfish needs. They feel lonely. Mm -hmm. Or get a big energy of, I feel lonely. I get an energy of, this is, this is just not good for you. Okay? Flat out. It doesn't nurture your soul. It doesn't nurture you in it any may, way. I think it makes you both toxic. This is really tough energy. And I mean tough as in it's, it's intensely... Um, towards the negative polarity. It's an energy and something can't grow. Right. So, who, you need to be having sweet thoughts of you. And you need to trust what... Or manifest that. Yeah. That, that divine counterpart, that twin flame that you want. You know, um, trust your gut. But you can manifest something better. There's something better for you. See how focused this tiger is? I have a whole story about this tiger that I will tell sometime. But this tiger is very focused. The energy of this tiger is, um, when we first started pulling this card out, um, I was at a time in my life where I felt a lot of Leo energy. I had never really connected with the Leo energy in my astrology. And I did, and it made me fierce. It made me fearless. 
and it made me stop caring so much about what other people thought. And it was extremely empowering. So that's a little side note for you on this little. This little. Now, if this is about someone um, you are inquiring about, I do feel like this is a fair warning for you. Mm -hmm. Just be cautious. Yeah. If you get that red flag that they're just not nurturing your soul, just say, ah, and pull back. Yes. Real quick. I'm not going to say not to talk to them or anything like that. Use your own good judgment, of course, with all of our readings. If you're just watching this, you know, hoping to manifest your significant other, I think this is just a side warning to um, people that you're drawing to you right now. Mm -hmm. And to take care of yourself and to heal from past relationships, definitely. Definitely. And get into your power again. Mm -hmm. You can do it. Mm -hmm. that's, anyway that's what I'm getting yeah that's what I've gotten so we hope this blesses you in some way and um, this is just um, a fun little light hearted reading we try to keep it light hearted anyway that was the goal um, um, we appreciate you being here we appreciate every single one of our subscribers and all of our views even you just clicking on our video yeah. we really appreciate you watching us um, we're grateful for you uh, leave us a comment and let us know what you think or if you resonated. We'd love to hear from you guys. Yeah. Um, and um, don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell button and like our video. And, and look for us on Facebook. We'll see you on the other side. Thank you guys. Bye.